So I'm just having a look at the control of this compressor. This was a fully working, it's a fully working machine, so take this black box off. These are all different, some clipping like that, some sliding and that. They are a pain to get off when the wires are all in, but you have to get them off, so. So I'm going to set this to ohms, and I'm going to pull these off, so you've got to relay at the bottom, and then the overload at the top, the overload protection, and they fit together like that. There's all sorts of different ones, so. Obviously that slots over the top one, or that way. That's your overload anyway. So there should be continuity between this pin and this top one. So that's just the resistance of the leads showing. If you touch the leads together. So that's good. And this one, you usually just, there's all sorts of different ones of these as well, but I reckon on this one you just push the leads in and you should get like a 5 ohms reading. Which I'm not getting. So obviously this one's gone faulty. Oh well, I was hoping that would be a good one for the film, but... Nope, it isn't. So it must have been dropped or something. So that's it anyway. I'll have to do another video when I get a good one that's working to compare it against. So I'll link to that in the video. So you just push them on. This one's going to go on first. Just better to put that on. So that's where your neutral goes. And on this one, you get a live down from your switch, from your thermostat switch. And you got obviously got your start winding and your run winding. So that's it. Make sure you check your wiring diagram though.